Did you know that you can use ChatGPT to create Word documents for you? It's true. In this video, I'll show you how. This is going to be fun. Let's get started. So many of you may know that it is possible to kind of connect Microsoft Copilot or even ChatGPT or other AI tools into Microsoft Word and use them from within Word. But in some ways and in some cases, it may be better to actually create your documents inside of ChatGPT. Here's how you can do it. Just log into your free ChatGPT account and describe the Word document that you want it to create for you. So there's the description of the document I want it to create, a resume for me. And I'm going to add to make sure the formatting looks professional. I'll submit this and let's see what ChatGPT creates. It looks like it's creating a wonderful outline for a resume. That's nice, but I want the actual document. But notice that I can go up here to the upper right and click download and it gives me the option of downloading this resume as a PDF document or a Microsoft Word document. And there's another option too. I'll click Microsoft Word. It downloads the resume. I can click to open it up in Microsoft Word. Let's take a look at what it looks like in Word. Because it was downloaded from the internet, it's not going to let me edit this document unless I click this button. Enable editing. Now it's enabled and I have full use of Microsoft Word. So take a look at what was produced by ChatGPT. It gives a nice summary of my experience and says it in a way that makes sense and uh, makes me look good. Of course, this is all very true true, everything in this resume, but just in case it's not complimentary enough about me, I can go in and add some commentary or other details. For example, here I could add the word unsurpassed and I could correct any errors. And then of course, I could put in my details here and here and here. Now, of course, as with pretty much all AI tools, I do not recommend that you just take what the AI produces and use it as your resume in this case, or as a lesson that you teach in class, or as a business presentation document, whatever it might be that you're working on, don't just turn that over to artificial intelligence completely. Use your own intelligence, of course, to enhance what's produced, to finish it off, make sure that it's accurate, make sure that it puts you in the best light in the example of a resume. But I love the potential of using ChatGPT to get me started on a resume about myself, and then I can change it to make it even more complimentary and to add more details that there's no way the AI could have known. So consider giving this a try. For now, I hope you found this video to be helpful. If you did, please like, follow, and subscribe. And when you do, click the bell and you'll be notified when I post another video. If you'd like to support my channel, the best way to do that is to become a channel member. But you could also click the thanks button below the video. You could support me through my Patreon account or by buying channel merch. And you'll see information about those options in the description below the video. Speaking of supporting the channel, I want to say thank you sincerely to my Super Techie channel supporters. Thank you so much for what you do to support the channel.